Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time we traipsed around the Snow Kingdom, had a little bit of fun swimming around and trotting our stuff. But today, we're getting a little hungry for some more Power Moons. So we're headed to the Lungeon Kingdom. Thank you for joining me. If you're having a good time and you'd like a little snack, like this video, comment, and subscribe. So after depositing our most recent cache of moons, we now only need 63 left to complete our mission. Hopefully we'll find a plethora of said moons here in the Luncheon Kingdom. Get popping on that. Oh. I don't even know where that is. I mean, the game normally shows me, but that's not really a good job of it. All right. That's fine, we're gonna get started here. Hello? Ooh, the cooking carnival. I mean, you should thank me for that. You guys didn't do anything, you're a bunch of bums. All right, let's talk to Hint Toad real quick. Hmm. And that's obviously pre Skyward Block Moon. Looks like I've already alluded to, I don't know where that is. So we're gonna go find it. It's gotta be over there, okay. What are you boys doing, huh? Oh, that's danger. Oops. Okay, probably should just do a reset here. Let that spiny push us. <laughs> push us. He's clearly not having a good time. He unalived himself. I'm saying that ironically, because I think that's dumb. It's one of the funniest things I think about social media is how there's so many people that are consumed in the process of sharing stuff to various platforms that they have to abide by these, like, really... Like, I don't know if I... I mean, I guess they are kind of arbitrary. I really like to just get you out of here. These very strange, like, who decides this? Who decides the rules of what you can and can't say on social media? To the point where you have to make words up. I'm just trying to go to the other side of the block here. I don't really need that entire... Whimsical... Launch cutscene. I was really struggling with words right there. Oops. I did not mean to do that. It said left stick, not LR or uh, left. Wait, what did I hit? ZL? Yeah, I don't even know what words are. We're struggling. It's a bit late when I'm recording this one. So this one's going to be a treat for you viewers, I promise. This is when my best, my best work comes out. My most opinionated nonsense that I feel about these things. Stop it. Anyway, yeah, so the point that I'm trying to make is... Yeah, who gets to decide that stuff? Like, who decides when... What things you can't say? Like, obviously, it's tricky. I'm not gonna pretend that... It just kind of feel like a, like a form of, like, pseudo-censorship, I guess. But, like, example, I don't know if this is gonna matter or, like, affect this video in any way, but... You know, the example that I was giving is how, like, on videos like this, you can't talk about when someone takes their own life. If you do refer to it as such, in its most pure form, like with the, the sewage, if you do that, you get poo-pooed on really hard by the algorithms. Sometimes your videos won't even get filtered or featured. And I noticed that too, like in certain platforms, you can't even swear. Like obviously I don't in my videos because I'm a purist and I'm a good boy. But I've noticed that in a lot of cases, you can't even use adult language in your videos. Like, period. Without the fear of demonetization, which is their way of censoring you. So, you got that going for you. Alright, I need to see, what's my list looking like here? Was that saying that there's a twofer? Can I talk to you? No, I already did. Hold on. 
Is that what this is referring to? Unless it's referring to up here, maybe there's a... There might be a chimney up here. I actually do really like the chimney challenges. There is. I have now come to understand that's what the two means. To be or not to be, to chimney or not chimney. Not my best work. But yeah, I mean, my point still stands, like, whatever. Censorship is, is, it is what it is. Like, everybody, there's gonna be somebody out there that's offended by things you say. Just a guarantee. Everybody's gonna have their, their feelings heard and their opinion want to be heard, etc. But who gets to decide what isn't isn't okay? I mean, obviously, it's got to be the people that are giving you the money, the advertisers. Who are just a bunch of big babies. I gotta get up on that. Whoop. Oh, yeah, viewers. I saw that from the get-go, flying over the lava islands. My big fear in um, making this video is that I'm not going to get enough moons because I don't know what I'm doing. I did not prep this one very well. I just want to grab one of you boys. Just one of you boys. Yeah. I do like the ability to plop through the grates. It's pretty awesome. And a boop. See ya. Bye. Alright. So it looks like... This is a pretty easy one. Yeah, that was a bit of a nothing burger. I'm a little disappointed in how easy that was. I look forward to these chimney challenges, and that was nothing like what we've done before. Like when I had to go scooting? Like, I like that one. But I am a bit under, uh, under plan. Didn't really do my, I did not do due diligence today. Sometimes I make myself a little note on what to do, and I did not do that today. So I know there's these. Is this new? Ooh, it's got a key. Viewers. Right. I gotta work quick. Double back. Alright, this is new. Ooh! I was not expecting Tetris blocks to just drop down from the floor. Not cool. Yeah, to finish off my thought, my fr my freeze peach thought, you know, I get to an extent, you know, you shouldn't, I feel like there's certain things you should not say. I feel like free speech is kind of a tricky commodity, especially because the internet is not dictated by any one country, per se, although, you know, a lot of Americans use it, so that's kind of where my idea of free speech comes from, but... You know, it is tricky because... Why don't I just do this? Yeah, that's dumb. But I think it's it's really arbitrary when I'm watching something and then I'll see, like, the person is clearly swearing in the video. Like, they've clearly dropped an F-bomb or something. And then the per the people editing this, because they know the, the dumb standards that social media has set for humanity, which I think social media is cancer in general. Um, but they'll, like... They won't even edit out the swear word. They'll just caption the swear with like an asterisk in the middle of it. All right, what's the theme for what? What's the, the theme for this video is is me hating censorship. I've become a monster. Um, I don't even know what that would be. I've become a monster. I'm assuming maybe they're referring to when we did the the final battle. With Bowser? What else what else would count? I've become a monster. Bowser battle one, two. I mean I'm not technically becoming Bowser. Climactic duo. I thought that, that's not what I was expecting. Uh that's all I can really think. Honey, hold on. Honey Loon Escape? Japanese? Oh, this worked? In the programming, it's going to be like one of those programming statements. It's like, 
an if then statement, which I don't know much about programming, but. Oh, thanks. It's gonna be like, if user puts song give moon, so it really doesn't matter what it is. It could be literally anything. All right, we only got four. I'm not doing great. Ooh, there's a rabbit. Sir, I'm gonna need you to come right the heck back. And boop. Oh yeah. Already got that one? That's lame. I don't like this song very much. This feels too more too much like Sonic Adventure. Although it would be better if it was Sonic Adventure because it would be uh, Crush 40. Live and learn. Great. The festival. You're welcome. Although it's got a bunch of goop in it. I think that bird died in it too. Toodling? Yeah, I don't know how to find these these boys. Was this here before? Ooh, there's a moon over there. I'm trying to see if there's any of these weird boys hanging out in the sky. We've been finding the occasional aircraft. Ooh. We went all the way over there? When did we do that? I don't remember that. Alright, that's fine. Although I did see... Yeah, this song just reeks of, like, Japan and May. I'm not... I'm not sure I care for it. To each their own, but it is not my vibe. I like the credits of, like, a Pokemon game. Paint? Yeah, we already did this. We already did the chef stuff, so I'm imagining we already got those. Is there anything new in here? Nope. I don't want to have to double up this place, but I might just because I didn't really prep very well. Oh, there's Peach. There we go. Hello. Look at that cutie outfit. She looks like a farmer. Peach, do you know where you are? This is not the agriculture kingdom. What a weird thing to say. That's like the that's like the outfit that somebody would wear. Yeah, and that underwater what does she keep saying that for? She's kind of wearing the outfit that like somebody that's like, oh yeah, I'm a farmer, or like somebody who wants to um somebody who wants to pretend like they want to pander, like they're like, oh I'm one of you, and then in reality they're not. They're just making a mockery of actual people that work hard and you know do things in agriculture and to try to feed humanity. Can this also be a moon? No, I did it. All right, that's a butt. Who's talking to over here? I'm feeling very underwhelmed with my performance. I apologize, viewers. I'm so sorry. Light the lantern. I feel like I already did that. Although I did see. I feel like I got the heck over here. Hello. There we go. I saw. There was, there was a moon, oops, probably was supposed to stop myself halfway to get full access to the, the leap. And boop, all right, there we go. Uh, all right, there we go. That felt a little bit dangerous. Ooh, is there another one of these things? The jutting crag, the aggro crag? From Global Guts, I don't want you. Here we go. This might be another moon. But this almost feels like this is like this song. I'm going to keep referring to it for a moment. It sounds like it's somebody that's not a native English speaker trying to sing a song in English, but you can't understand what they're saying. That's just the vibe I get. Scooby doo 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 doo. I have no idea what you're saying. Like they can only find somebody that. You know, knows English on the side, maybe. Some Japanese singer. They're like, hey, can you know English? And they're like, I can make it up. And sing English sounding things. Alright, I don't know. How do I get the. How do I get back to where I was? Is there a. Oh, yeah, I just went the. You know, the opposite direction of where I need to be. Can you get out of my way? Get out of my face. Yeah, this is just like too, 
too cheesy for me. <laughs> I get it. All right, how do I get over there? I think I need to... I hope that doesn't disappear. That'd make me very annoyed. Let me make myself a platform. I mean, the song itself is catchy, it just seems a little strange for the environment. For the environment. All right, here we go. Can I get over there from here? Can I get over there from here? Whoa! Ooh, that scared me. I was like, where am I going? This better amount to something. I went all this way for this radish. You betcha. There is a really funny video out there. I want to say it's made by some Italian group where they basically just tried to fake English, like what English sounds like to people who aren't native English speakers. And it's just a bunch of gibberish. That video really made me laugh. All right, so we can just warp up here. This is where we got to be that giant slab of meat before, if we remember that. That was enjoyable. There's Captain Toad over there. We'll have to go back to that. But first, time to sweep this chimney. Can I turn this off? Like, uh, this song is really annoying. I don't like any of it. Uh, where am I? I, mean, I guess this is better than whatever random, like, wistful. Ooh, I'm not expecting that. Hold on. Do I need to do this? Yeah, no, this doesn't really get me excited. This just feels awkward. Uh, what? Oh, I have to use this boy. Come here. Get over here. No. I need your help. Weird mouth thing. Yeah. Oh, not quite it. There we go. All right, I'm gonna go and kill my compadre here. Bye, boy. I feel like I'm doing a lot of complaining in this episode. It makes me sound very curmudgeon-y. D-Mike doesn't like anything. He doesn't like popular things. Oh, you butthole. No, I do like things. I just, I don't know. Maybe I am being unfairly critical of this stuff, but also part of it I don't feel like I am. He doesn't like things for the sake of liking things. No, stop it. Get over here. Use your mouth on me. Okay. Ooh. Here we go. Am I supposed to be lighting these? I don't know. I feel like I need you. Oh, but Poop and crap. Yeah, I'm liking the 8-bit version of this way better. Does it reset the music if I die, please? Oh, thank God. Oh. I can definitely vibe with this way more. Oh, I have to redo all of this? That is a butt. I don't care for this at all, viewers. At least I understand it now. But yeah, I, I much more... This is danger. I much more enjoy the... You know, what we're, what we're dealing with here than instead of the... I'm not a much of a blue blopper, if you can tell. So we're doing okay though. Viewers, are we doing okay? I missed all my, my whining. Hopefully you're having a good time. I'm so sad though. We're getting so close to the end of this game. It makes me bummed out. The finale of this game is going to be a mess. I know that because I said so. All right, so almost at the quota for moons. Did I miss one of the torches? I had to have because it would have given me a secondary. Oh, it's over here. What? Do you just have to throw fireballs off the thing? I think you do. Yeah, you thought you had me. Wrong. Boom, I figured you out. 
in this game for babies. All right, well, it's pretty good recovery. I mean, this this episode started out really poorly, and this is being done with um, between zero and zero percent planning. So I'm feeling pretty happy about the results here, but I need to get over there. I need to go talk to Captain Chode real quick. I do believe there is a bubbly boy here. But we are coming up on the end of this wonderful series. I am a little sad. That final episode though I'm very nervous about because I know from what I've seen it's a doozy. The final challenge of the game. Sizzle time! Thanks buddy. I don't know how many of these were actually moons that I should have been getting a million years ago, but that is 10 moons, so... How do I get back? Good question. He's like, well, I guess I'm dying here. This is the end of the line for Captain Toad. Alright, come on. Bring it around town. We don't have time to waste. There we go. Yeah, these, these captures are fun. These are also some of the more goofy ones. Where is this sending me? Yeah, I bet there's probably... Do you get anything for going in the pot? Thanks for the advice as I just smash my body into your face. Let me check the map real quick. Uh. Oh, wait, there's something else here? That's where we just were. Ooh, wait. Koopa free running at viewers. Viewers. I don't know where that is in relation to me, so... Uh, it should just be in the pot. Just a race around the pot. Ooh, there's one of these. I'm not expecting this. Maybe I clear some of the, the goop out of the way real quick. It seems like this would make my life a lot easier, so I'm gonna try it this way. Give myself my future self a little bit of help because I don't know what this is going to be. Alright, here we go. Ooh, I don't like that. Oh, actually, maybe I kind of do. A little bit of a vertical challenge. Test your 4D skills. 3D? I don't even know. I don't even know what 4D is. Oh, I missed. Here's my on target. Okay, so that wasn't great. <laughs> we will try this again. Yeah, it's like it's a little bit difficult to see where you are in lateral space. And I'm actually like pulling back on some of these. Ooh, this is even worse than before. Alright, third time's a charm. Here we go. Semi charmed life. Are you kidding me? You just basically have to be lined up with it. And if you're not, you're just screwed. And this one has like the weird triple jump to it. Little baby hops. Yeah, I am I am holding back on the control stick when I land. I didn't love that. Not the not the biggest fan of that. But I am surprisingly more I love a big pot. I'm surprisingly more effective in this run than I was expecting to be. It still looks like it's over here. To Koopa free running. Where? I mean, I, oh, that. Well, it would help if I wasn't going to the wrong side. Man, this is a masterclass in not knowing where I'm going. Okay. I'm trying to think. Where is he? Ooh, I see another one of those things. Oh boy. Oh, I can run on this. I see a moon down there. Whee! Do you see this, viewers? Ooh. This is crazy. What are these jelly beans doing here? This is... Yeah, I'm doing way more better than I thought I was going to. I'm actually kind of shocked at how well I'm doing, but... We'll finish off this episode with our bro. Heck yeah. I only say that because I don't think I'm going to be able to do this well enough to 
get it in one try. But the bacon, of all the places to hunt for it, is that at the top? Don't do this. Game, come on. I feel like I'm into one of the boys. There's one, like one of my blobby boys. Okay. Let's take a uh, fire damage twice. I'm gonna, okay. I should have long jumped. If you pizza when you french fry. I thought I was gonna be able to make it though. Like I didn't think that it was gonna be a problem. These didn't seem like these were that far apart. Okay. That's a uh, taking damage for... Oh boy, this is bad. Viewers, we're not doing so great. We're gonna keep... Oh, I didn't even realize I fell in the goo. Oops. Fell in the gosh dang goo. My bad. Yeah, this is why I said we're gonna finish the episode. It's my subtle way of saying that I don't think I'm good enough to... Yeah. Look how patient they are. What's that move that they're doing? Like, they wait. And then... They do like a little hop where they... It looks like they get an unfair advantage. There's a bunch of cheaters. That's what it looks like to me. Leave it to these boys to be cheaters. I do like the, the fact that they that they do wait. Oh, that should have been pure disaster. Oops. Ran into a big block of cheddar. Cheddar cheese. Yeah, this is not this is not going well. What I need is. I don't know if those boys are in this in this level. Also, I feel like there's like a little bit of RNG involved with the platforms. Whoop. So we're this is not going well. Ugh. We're gonna keep trying. I reserve the the end of the episode just for this. So we're gonna try. Our hardest, our most hardest. As we land on these giant piles of salt. See, what is this? What What is that move that they're doing? Do you see that? Oh, so that's not the button. I, I meant to hit long jump and it didn't give it to me. Is this... This is tough. This is probably one of the, the more harder ones. I do want to get it though. I feel like this is a nice... A nice moon to finish today's episode on though. Don't eat, don't eat Cappy, you greedy little boy. Oof. This is brutal. I do. I mean, I have a million billion lives, so we might as well. I wonder if anybody's ever chewed through like a hundred lives just trying to do the Koopa free running. I just wish I knew the cheese of this one, which is even funnier that I say that in an episode about food. Watch this. What is that BS? Like, what are they? What are they running into? Seems like incredibly unfair. Whatever they're doing, I don't like it. No. There needs to be a cheese. And I want to know it immediately. Gotta watch out for the giant boulder. Ooh, what's oh, a pepper? I thought it was cheese. I feel like I am wildly behind. Oh, there's a boy. Give me this boy. Yes. Oh, he's waiting for it to turn over. He's like, oh. See, they even they have to sometimes ab abide by the rules. Ooh, what if I can get this? Boy, what do you think about that, huh? Is this where I'm supposed to be going? I don't know. I'm in fifth now? Oh, he finished. Oh, I was close. 
All right, so I get the idea now. Viewers, you've seen the path forward. You know what to do. No, I don't want your pity. I don't want your pity consolation prize. Second place is first loser, all right? I know how to do it now. Maybe if I pay a little bit more attention. Yeah, you don't even have to go all the way up there. But I do want to know what that little BS move is that they do. Where they, they skip it. it. Just seems unfair. Like here, this is fine. In this, in this specific instance, but like in the other ones, ooh. Use the invincibility frames, the old eye frames. All right, we're doing more better this time, I think. Watch over the pepper, the pooper. Whoop, not today, baby. Whoop, didn't even hit that. Oh, where's our boy at? There he is. Oh, I missed. Come on. Don't do this to me. Game. I don't have time for this. Alright, so we can just skip this up here, I think. Oops. Yeah, boy! That's the cheese. You don't have to go all the way around. That took 21 last seconds. So that's immensely faster. I feel pretty good about that. Blazing fast, bro. 420 blaze it. That was 13 moons. In a pretty quick amount of time. Where's this go? I just want to look at this real quick. Because I don't know what this is. Uh, this looks like something. This is something I've already done. I just want to happen, what, see what happens if I light this on fire. Really quick. Real quick. And then I will pop off. And bid you all adieu. Okay, I have done this. So this was pointless. That's fine. And I burned myself on the way out. But that's okay. We had a good time. We enjoyed ourselves in this episode. So I'm going to call it quits here while Mario is singed. So thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey. And I'll catch you guys next time for more. Like them YouTube shorts. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.